What's up everybody? Today we're working on white trash again, getting it ready for the next gambler, Tennessee Redemption run. Um, I did go ahead and get this rear window taken out and just threw on this thin piece of plastic here. Um, I filmed a time lapse of taking the glass out, so we'll go and put that in right here. But then when it came to putting this stuff on here, it's uh, really thin and it was pretty hard to work with. Kind of rough cut it and threw some self tappers in it just to get through the next gambler. Uh, I was afraid I wouldn't be able to build something in time. So this was just a cheap, easy fix uh, just the last couple weeks. And then after the gambler, we can rip this out of here and actually build something. But today I need to get the uh, lights in here wired up get the snorkel back on it and then at the last gambler the tires were hitting up in here so I think I've still got a um, spacer back here so I think I'm gonna pull that spacer off and see if I can't make it to where more of the tire will tuck inside there instead of getting caught on the body but first thing we'll uh Go ahead and knock out these lights. All right, so didn't really think I needed to show everything in the time lapse, but got this stuff wired in, two separate wiring harnesses. Um, I got two switches left on the panel, so that works out pretty good. Pod lights are on one switch, and the little bar is on the other switch. Got everything with my uh, wired in with connectors and stuff, and then into the cabin it goes in the same place that the factory wire harness does and then in here I had a little battery I was just testing it out but got my two separate harnesses so I'm just going to uh, run the grounds and then run two powers up to the switch panel up there and then uh, put the battery back in and we'll test it out to Make sure everything works like it should.
All right, snorkel's back on. It's flopping around, looking goofy as always. And uh, went ahead and got the jack back here, so we'll go ahead and pick this up. Just gonna do one side at a time and uh, get this spacer off here. See what kind of a difference it makes. And there's our little one inch spacer. So I don't think it's gonna make too big of a difference, but hopefully it won't catch on this as much because uh, whenever it does hit, it kind of cameras in a little bit. I don't know if it's gonna move that much though, but it's worth a shot. Uh, I'm gonna take the spacers to the gambler with me. So if I need to, I can always just put them back on. So rip this off, put that back on there and uh, see what kind of difference it makes. And if you're wondering, this one's a 15 by seven with a two inch back spacing. Looking kind of weird. Really used to seeing that tire poked way out. Sits pretty much flush with that fender flare now though. But we're gonna run it like this at the next gambler and see if it does any better. Might be worse. I don't know, we'll find out. Go ahead and get the spacer off this side, get it back as close as I can, and then uh, whenever it gets dark outside, we'll pull it out and uh, turn all the lights on and everything and see how all that stuff looks all lit up with the uh, extra pods in the bar up here. So knock that out and then we'll see y'all when the sun goes down. Everything all lit up. Got the uh, spacers off the back, got the snorkel back on. Got a temporary window in. But uh, should be gambler ready. So we'll get back to working on this van. And uh, so I guess that's gonna be all for this one. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe.